guys, it's the end of the year and today we are right here at Belgravia Ace. My name is Ainsley and today we're going to be doing our usual SRI New Homes Showcase and this time for a cluster lender. This is the last and final phase of the Belgravia Ace uh, whole collection and we're going to find out from Ken a little bit more about the developer right inside. So if you're ready, let's go for the show flat tour. And of course, as mentioned, this is the final phase of the Belgravia series Strata Lender and we're going to have Ken to share us a little bit more about Tong Eng Group. What's so special about them? Tell us a little bit more about this developer. So Tong Eng Group is a reputable developer in Singapore for more than 60 years and they have a prestigious track record of award-winning projects such as Wilshire Residences, they have Tree Balmora, Good okay. Grand yep. and of course in the recent years, they have been focusing a lot on their Belgravia series where they have successfully built and developed Belgravia Villas and Belgravia Green and of course lastly Belgravia Ace where we are standing today. So it seems like they've got a lot of um, experience in the whole strata lender and this being the final phase of it all. Um, I'm sure this will be the best collection of them all because uh, this itself is the final phase. Yes. So I think Tong Eng has actually successfully brought together all the good and bad points uh, to change and come up with a best product in Belgravia Ace today after the years of experience in building the Belgravia series. In fact, it was so good that they have recently been awarded oh, the best oh. strata landed oh. and the best landed developer in 2021 by Property Guru. Very nice. So Belgravia Ace uh, is on Belgravia Drive off Amokyo Avenue 5, located within well sought after Salita Hills Estate, one of the largest landed enclave in the Northeast region. Um, Ken, do share with us about the insides of the area and uh, you know all the things that we do not know about the area. Okay, so like you rightly pointed out, Ainsley, Belgravia Ace is actually located within District 28. So it is very close proximity to upcoming Salita Regional Centre, which can potentially be twice the size of our Tampanese Regional Centre. It is also very near to the hype up Congo Digital District, which spells the future for Singapore. And of course, it is flanked by four MRT lines, namely your North South, North East, and Thompson East Coast Line, and with the upcoming Cross Island Line as well. Belgravia Ace is located within just four minutes short drive away from CTE. And so you mentioned it's about 290,000 square feet of uh, Belgravia Ace, right? That's a land size. So what's so special about living in such a big strata land development? So traditionally, we have a group of buyers who are always looking out for larger living spaces. They either choose conventional landed or they go into strata landed. And for those who go into strata landed, they usually are people who would like to enjoy landed living, yet at the same time enjoy facilities from the condominiums, right? So being on a larger land plot like Belgravia Ace, yep. it is it allows families to enjoy proper facilities, wider arrays of amenities and facilities within the development itself. More pool, more water features, bigger gyms, more communal spaces which are extremely important in today's environment, right? So that, that bigger land plot is extremely important. For sure, I agree. So talking about bigger land plot, I also noticed a very, very long, big driveway. They were looking at right here. I mean, what's, what's this all about? So indeed, this driveway is a special feature in Belgravia Ace. Mm. As residents and visitors, as they drive into Belgravia Ace, they get greeted by a very nice entrance. Yep. And as they go into this entire 100 meters long driveway, they will see large red trees that are being flanked on the left and right to provide a very nice scenic drive as you enter into the development. Yeah, I, I still notice that it's a really long driveway. It doesn't look like anything that we usually see in Singapore. Why so special? What's the difference? So in fact, you know I just came back from London. Yes. And as we visit the countryside, this entire driveway actually reminds me of a lot of the castles, right, the grand castles, right, right. the palace. Yes. Where you drive in and then eventually you will see a very grand palace at the yep. end. And that's exactly what the developer wanted to bring across in Belgravia is. For sure. Yes, as you can see, as you drive in, you then get greeted by a grand roundabout yep. fountain. Hmm. And of course, you are being greeted again by the grand clubhouse, which takes centre stage of the entire development yep. before we fan out on the left and right of the individual houses. Very nice. Alright Ken, so I noticed so many units that are right here at Belgravia Ace. Uh, give us a little bit of the breakdown, the overview of Belgravia Ace. So let me try and summarise the entire thing easily so that everybody can understand in this video. I sure. think the details will leave it when you, when you come down to the of show course. flat, right? Um, so there are a total of 107 houses that are being built on Belgravia Ace mm. with 104 of them being the semi Ds sure. and three of them being the terraces. Right, okay. Right, so the three are very limited and probably the lower pricing because the yeah. sizes are a bit smaller. Sure. Right, so in order for you to understand better, there are a total of four types. We have the type A, which is this entire first row. And of course, type B, I will, I will touch more on type A later to show you how unique type A are. And then of course, we have type B, which is sitting on the back of this entire row. And the rest will be type C, 
and type D will then fall into these three terraces that are sitting over here. Right. Right. So what is so unique about type A is that we have heard from the architect that he has wanted to do this for a long, long time, but right. he couldn't find a strata landed of such a land size to allow him to do that. Right. So the unique point here is that type A actually acts really like a conventional landed. We can park right in front. Yes. So uh, what you see from the driveway, as the cars enter, they turn left or right in yes. their units. They actually park on the ground level. Yes, yes. Whereby they have an automated gate and the cars can just enter and it acts totally right. like a, a as a conventional ladder. And you only get this on type A, right? Yes, on okay. type A. Sure. And what is unique about this portion is that type A, although they are classified as semi D, yep. uh, but because their linkage of the other unit is from the back of the of the house. Okay. Makes so sense. when you look from the front, they actually it looks look like, like a standalone bungalow. Right, yeah, it does. Right. Yeah, so it's actually the, the, the party or the sharing was actually behind. Right? Yes. Okay. So the semi day is not the, the usual kind where you see from the side to side. Oh, sure. And that's what you will see in type C of the semi days later. Right. Right. So only type A allows you to park on the surface level, B, C, and the rest will all be on the basement. Right. Okay, makes sense. Right. Yep. So this is also one of the main points why I said that Tong Ying has created such a beautiful strata landed development that we don't usually see For because sure. of the conventional landed feel that you have on the first row, yep. the back-to-back semi days that you are looking at, which stands out to be a detached house by itself. Very, very nice. So Ken, you mentioned so much of good stuff about Type A. Um, what about the rest of the types, the B, C, D? I mean, what's, what's so good about it? Okay, so other than Type A being a conventional like yep. that, there are people who actually love different views in front of their houses. Mm. So Type B, in fact, is the largest of all types. Okay. They have the largest build-up size and everything. Sure. If you can see this, these two rows of facilities, there will be buyers who want to have a quiet facing of the lawn where they can sure. hang out yep. and walk with kids running about. Yep. And there are some other buyers who definitely want to face the swimming pool. Mm. They get a choice to face the quieter water feature, the Very children's nice. play yep. area. Of course. Or at the back row where they face the entire 50 meters lap pool, have the convenience mm. to look at their kids or family swimming or even host friends and family over for parties and they, they get to enjoy the facilities right for in sure, front. Sure. And this, this brings back to the main point of Belgrave River is sitting on more than 290,000 square feet of land. Yep. And these are all the facilities that you get to enjoy, which you don't find in other strata landed developments. Right, so, and if if you can take a peek over there, um, the gym size is actually large as well. I right. don't think you can find it anywhere else. Now that we've seen the whole development, we are currently standing right here at Belgrave A's uh, Type B um, car porch, right? Yes. It's really, really big. Uh, how many cars are we looking at? How big is this place? So we have a frontage of approximately 9 meters. Sure. And I think easily we can park up to 3 cars. Okay. Um, which is a very good frontage because um, sure. a lot of the conventional landed uh, buyers who are looking at semi-D, yep. um, they hope to at least get uh, close to 10 meters and this is yep. a perfect frontage for owners. Absolutely. I mean, 3 cars, strata landed. I tell you what, let's go head in and check out the unit itself. Let's go. So Tong Ying Group has actually future-proofed their houses in Belgravia Ace. They have provided charging points for owners with EVs. So coming into the basement, we noticed a lot of storage spaces. I mean, look at that. And there are like three panels. Are all these provided for care? Yes, in fact, these are actual provision for the mm. houses. With these three panels, you can easily fit up to almost 70 pairs of shoes. Okay. Right. And even behind me over here, they have actually storages that are good for your luggages and everything. Right. So if you're traveling, you don't need to lock it up and down. You can actually right. just hide, place okay. it here and get up from here. That makes a lot of sense. Yes. Fantastic. Um, so I think all the storages that we see in the basement, what else do we have in the basement itself? So for type B and C, yep. other than the storages that you see in the car porch that's just outside, yep. you actually have a home shelter, okay. which doubles up as a storage, okay. and of course a WC that's tucked at the corner. Right. And you have a lovely home lift, private home lift down here. You know what, this is perfect for multi-generational families. Right? Yes, perfect for elderly if they are staying together and they can just be mobile. I like it. Right. And for type A, yep. type A comes with an additional room which you can we can see the floor plan when you are down in the show flat. Very nice. Right. So we're here on the first level of the house. Probably one of my favorite part of the, the entire house itself because of this very good frontage of up to six meters, which provide a very good distance between the TV area and the sofa area. So what everybody loves about this house is the super high ceiling of 4.58 meters that gives a very spacious and luxurious feeling of Belgrave Ace houses. So I love how the developers have used 60 by 60 luxurious marble floor tiles to spruce up the entire level one 
As we walk along here, we have a very nice segregation of your dining area. So as you can see, this entire spacious living and dining area is supported by three aircon units of the latest plasma quad that comes with a air purifying device on the top of every unit. So yes, it's perfect for the current situation that we are all in now. So as we move along, you can see a very nice grand dry kitchen, if you can call it a celebrity dry kitchen, where you can actually have your breakfast over here. If you look over there with the glass cabinet, those are ID. What we have are actually recessed area to be able to have chairs for you to, to have your breakfast here and it's repeated over on the other side. So you can actually sit up to four people on this dry kitchen itself. As we come over here, um, you can see that they are, they are flush with very high-end finishing from Vizuk on the induction cooker, the steam oven and the oven itself. A lot of cabinetry is being placed right at the bottom of this dry kitchen. And so because of the grand 4.58 meter ceiling height, the developer has actually provided a free furniture loft that is not included in your strata area for all houses within Belgrave East. With this height that we have, the furniture loft itself still stands at 1.98 meters that is comfortable enough for people to move around and which can double up as a study area or even as a very small guest room. So now let's take a very quick glimpse of the rest of the house. So there has been a very bullish uptrend in the recent year for strata lenders in both the primary and secondary market. There has been steep increases in rental and transacted prices for strata lenders itself. I think this is mainly caused by three key reasons. One of the reasons will be the new work from home norm. Because of the COVID situation, parents working from home find that the normal three and four bedroom condominiums are already not large enough for them in the current state they are in. Secondly, they are highly appreciative of the extensive facilities that they find, especially in developments such as Belgrave Ace, whereby they get to enjoy in the privacy and the comfort and safety of their own development. And last but not least, in the recent years, conventional landed prices have gone up very steeply. Supply has been on a very low and buyers are getting frustrated not being able to find their choice units in the conventional landed segment. And a lot of them are now shifting into strata landed as a very good alternative for their families. And that marks the end of our SRI New Home Showcase. If you are looking for a strata landed of this size, please do not miss out. All these 107 units will be going on a preview on the 8th of January 2022. We will see you next year right here at Belgravia A's. See ya!